Hello, Musical Monarchs. I wanted to take just a moment to talk to you, um, just to share a few thoughts. This is something I'm going to start doing on these weekly calls. Every week, there will be some little tidbit, just a short little thought or a, a lesson. It'll either be um, offering some clarity on some of the things that we're working on on the piano or talking about some technique or talking about some bigger picture, bigger mindset sort of things. So I wanted to share with you, I have actually, um, I last Christmas, I subscribed to um, Masterclass. Okay, so I bought, they were running some sort of special at the time and it was, um, it was um, buy one, get one. Anyway, I got that for myself and for my dad. And um, a brand new masterclass just came out on there. And it's a masterclass by Yo-Yo Ma. Now, Yo-Yo Ma, if you are not familiar, is a very famous cellist. I know the name of exactly one cellist, and it's Yo-Yo Ma. So hopefully you've heard of him. If not, you should definitely look him up and, and, um, and check him out. He has been playing the cello for a very long time. Um, I, and, and I've come across him recently um, in a couple of different venues, and I really love what he has to say. So um, here's, here's one of his quotes um, here on his website. He says, all the things I love about life outside of music um, have to do with people and playing the cello allows me to fulfill all those interests through music. So I was um, listening to this masterclass and, and he says, you know, he's been playing the cello for a very long time. And he says he used to have this um, idea that he could play a perfect concert and he says one day he you know he'd been working towards that and one day he was in the middle of a concert and he realized he had not made a single mistake so far he was and he was bored to death <laughs> so one of the things he was talking about in that master class was the importance of that connection with your audience and your that connection with other people and i kind of touched on this um Oh, probably six weeks ago um, when we were talking at the end of um, most of your six week course and um, and how it's music isn't about perfection, right? It's about that connection with other people. So he kind of echoed that. And then he shared, you know, a way to deal with being nervous. So, you know, and you can see this is somebody who performs all the time. You can see <laughs> lots of um, lots of different performance venues as you scroll through, but um, one of the things that he said he says he'll have people who ask him, "Do you get nervous when you perform?" And he says, "Yes, I still get nervous when I perform. I still get nervous when I speak in public and and do all of these things." But he's found a secret, um, something that helps him with that. And he says what he does is he pretends like he is going to be, like he is hosting a party and everybody who is there is there as his guest. And he has something like that he's going to share in the party, right? So when you have a party and you're hosting, sure. you've prepared food and you've prepared all these um, delights, right, for the party. And you didn't do it because you're trying to show off. You did it because you hope that your guests are going to have a good time, that they are going to enjoy that. And your guests, of course, come hoping that they will enjoy that as well. And that is the mindset that he takes into those performances, that, that mindset of being the host, of presenting something that he believes that, that others will enjoy, and that they in turn really are hoping to enjoy. So they're there to receive and they come to have a good time. And, you know, he says, there's always something that happens at a party. No party is perfect, right? There's always something that, that is not quite perfect, but that's okay because it's not about that too, anyway, right? It's not about perfection. It's not about um, everything being perfect. It's about that connection with, the audience. It's about that connection with other people. So that's my little um, message for this week. I hope that um, you guys are doing great with the 
the course, the follow-up course, or um, we have a new member who's probably going to start on the six-week course next week. So um, I hope that we'll get to see him in the Monarch channel and hear from him soon. And, um, you know, drop me an email or send me a message. I would love to hear how it's going. Uh, the next two weeks, I will um, release some other little tidbit, something to enjoy in the channel. And and then after that, we'll be going at jumping into our Christmas course. I've got it all outlined, and I think it's going to be a lot of fun. So I hope you all are well. And um, until next time, play on.